Just what do you think you're doing over here, you jerk? Look at this guy. Look at him trying to go ahead and just like wander into our spot and eat some of our rabbits. Hello everyone and welcome back to Wolf Quest 3 where we are frantically chasing away this golden eagle who apparently thinks that it is totally appropriate to go ahead and to try to eat some of the rabbits that we have scattered about our home, which is absolutely not true. Also, we're completely exhausted so we do need to go ahead and get some rest. Oh my gosh, we do need to go ahead and get some rest even though Lark is very sick. So you guys, this could be the sleep that actually determines if Lark survives or not. And we are only two rabbits away from being able to get the 12 lucky rabbits, or 100, excuse me, the 100 lucky rabbits that we are working on. I'm just so scattered because we're on the very edge of being able to succeed in so many ways. And then in a bunch of other ways, everything is getting a little bit dangerous. Let's go ahead and howl for just a moment. The eagle is like absolutely freaking out. And we're actually going to go ahead and take a little nap because for some reason, everything is moving in slow motion. There we go, now it's better. All right, maybe we won't nap just yet. I'm so nervous that Lark is gonna die. Also, this golden eagle keeps trying to mess with our food. Like, get away, you jerk. This is ours. All right, Iacin is hanging out with Clover. Lark is getting sicker, so we're going to try to spend a little more time with him. Demeter is too exhausted to be able to protect her family in case of, like, incursion of stranger wolves or anything like that. So I think we're going to have to sleep. But at the same time, maybe I could just hunt the final two rabbits really quickly. If I could just get- Get away, you jerk! Like, we have not adopted a, like, a, a golden eagle. You're not allowed to just move in like that. It, that's not how this works. All right, come on, Lark. Hang in there, little buddy. What are you doing? <laughs> like, go away. There we go, you're okay, Lark. See, we'll take care of you. We'll chase away that eagle. Like, seriously, you're not allowed here. Get out of here, what do you think you're doing? No, you can't be here. Like, literally, get out of here. What is this? <laughs> this is hilarious. I have never seen one of the golden eagles just be like, no, I'm just gonna spend all my time like right here. I don't know what you're talking about. Maybe it's just like, are you kidding? This is free food. You've already hunted it. I'm not leaving. All right, I might have all of the pups go ahead and maybe get undercover. Because I think I'm going to hunt two more rabbits before we sleep. Just in case Lark puts on... He's not going to put on that much weight. But... Ah, ah. Okay. We're totally exhausted. You know what, guys? We're just going to try it. I don't want to have this nap. I don't want to have this nap. We'll stay with Lark. Come on, buddy. Oh! <gasps> <gasps> My heart is going like a hundred miles an hour right now. He's healthy again! No way! At like 16, 11%, whatever it was left, he's healthy and he only has four more pounds of weight to put on. We're gonna be able to do it, you guys! Oh my gosh, celebratory howl! This is wonderful. What's not wonderful is the eagle overhead. So help me if he gets eaten by an eagle just as we managed to go ahead and wrap wrap up like this event. Like, go away! I can't believe you are still here. Like, what is this? We are not sharing our den, or excuse me, our, our rendezvous site with an eagle. I can't leave an eagle as a babysitter. ISN, you stay here. I'm gonna go get two more rabbits so we can complete Demeter's life quest without having to be like worried without having to be worried that we won't manage to before everybody's ready for the summer hunting ground okay which way did the snowshoe hair go this way five minutes ago Ten nope this way all right wait was that it no all right so it's somewhere this direction <gasps> there it is all right all right rabbit number 99 
Oh, thank goodness. So we are at rabbit number 99. One more and we will complete her life quest. And then I think we will actually manage to wrap all of this up right in time, right on time. I'm amazed. Even though we ended up having such a different life compared to her sibling, or excuse me, her cousin, her second cousin at this point, um, Basil, I'm going to be amazed if they manage to like finish raising both their litters almost at the same time. Like, kind of really proud too. Because finishing a complete generation, I'm already grinning from ear to ear. Finishing a complete generation always feels so good. And again, you guys, we had two totally different experiences with Basil and a totally different experience with our girl Demeter. I really love having both of the wolves go side by side and you guys have been so supportive that we will probably keep it up another generation. I actually think it makes it a really, really fun. Also something, maybe that sow grizzly killed a bull bison, like what? But we'll probably keep it up another generation just because we've been having such a good time. You guys have been so supportive and such good sports. And I actually think it makes both the stories stronger to have the two to compare and contrast. Because whenever you can compare and contrast, like, okay, last rabbit, is this gonna be our 100th rabbit? <gasps> There we go! Our 100th rabbit, you guys! Boom. I'm so proud right now. 100. We did it. It is a challenge. It is a fun challenge. I could actually see others of the pack in the future wanting to become part of Demeter's like legacy. They could, because we always call them the starry skies when our wolves have their legacy maybe we could go ahead and consider uh, let's see all right Iason's actually hungry let's see if we can find where that bison carcass is that we scented if it's anywhere close by as we work our way back home we'll call him over to us but i i don't see it so maybe we'll, we'll go back and we'll let him go hunting whilst we keep an eye on the kids <laughs> oh but I could actually see in the future wolves who pick up the same life life quest in case we really liked that life quest and we want to do it again or it really fits a personality of the wolf in the future. We'll actually say that they're part of the same constellation because I like to imagine and we will actually have a wiki and everything dedicated to making this happen. ISN, we're bringing you back lunch. Sorry, little Mew and Dolphin. This is just the way life is. So sorry. Your mom had two kids, I think, and she left you behind. There we go. Now we have lunch for Ayasin, so he doesn't need to worry. But I, we do, we are going to be keeping track of all of the wolves we have. And when they gain fame points, they become brighter in the starry skies. They basically become stars that are either bronze, silver, or like diamond, I guess. And they end up becoming brighter is kind of what we're saying. And one day we might even do some artwork to reflect that. So, if you end up picking the same life quest, oh my gosh, I can't believe we're suddenly raising an eagle as well. If you end up picking the same life quest, then you'll become part of the constellation of other wolves who has also completed that. We didn't bring this here for you to eat. Go away. And I really like that idea. I assume there's plenty of food if you want some. All right, so we're just waiting for Lark to get a little bit bigger. We might go ahead and take a nap in just a moment. I can't believe we're like, Clover's careful. I can't believe we're just like raising an eagle. Go away. Go away, like how long, he, he's actually stuck around after we took a nap and everything. We'll try taking one more nap while the pups are all close to us keeping an eye out. Can't believe this eagle just thinks that it can swoop in and suddenly join the pack. That's not how this works. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, little ones, we're almost there. And we're like one pound away. Okay, we're gonna let everybody eat and then we're gonna sleep one more time. I think we finally lost the eagle that was still here because the dawn moon pack has to finish at during like daytime. Come on. That's just absolutely a given. All right. What's that? 
It's a rabbit, and you know what? We're gonna let it go ahead and go because we have collected all of the lucky rabbit's feet we need. And I'm proud and happy about that. I hear something. I hear something! Are you kidding me? Where's the bear? Where's the bear? We're literally almost to the end. And then a bear? No, 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 no. You aren't allowed. You aren't allowed. No, get away from my puppies. Oh my gosh. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. No, you're not allowed to have my puppies at the last minute. We're literally about to go ahead and finish this. You can't do this. Oh my gosh. Literally at the last second. At the very last second. I can't believe that happened. Like at the very last second. And there we go. <laughs> Somehow that made Lark be like, okay, I'm ready to grow up and leave now. <laughs> there we go, you guys. Literally at the last second, we were able to keep our puppies alive. I am blown away. Good job, Demeter. Demeter and Ayasin had a completely different story than I was expecting. I am so happy and so proud about them. I I'm I love I love what we've done here. And I love what we did with Basil and with Catalina and with their puppies. I'm just really blown away by everybody. Wow, we made it. We kept everybody alive. Oh, this is wonderful. And we learned just so much about new ways that we can enjoy the beautiful world that they have been in. Let's go ahead and have one last rise of dawn with the dawn pack because that is extremely fitting. And then next time, my friends, we're going to go ahead and see what it looks like when these three little ones are all grown up and ready to potentially become the heirs to the Dawn Moon pack. I'm pretty sure we will carry on with both packs as usual, but I'm gonna go ahead and see what we think if everybody's grown up and we kind of have their randomized personalities and we have some of their life quest. So let me know what you guys think. Not happy about the fact that somehow we have somehow adopted a eagle. Let me know what you guys think about that, too. Maybe it's going to make one of the puppies extremely curious about birds. Ah, but most importantly, my friends, stay curious. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.